comes in this little uh, cup. This little pack which uh, holds all your filters in. I just stuck a bit of tape on it to keep it closed because the mechanism doesn't close that well. And then you got your filter here. And you pull that out. And you got a cup and your plunger. And then inside then you got a filter. So yeah, you pop your coffee in there. Push your plunger down, comes through the bottom into your cup, into there. And I'm using black gold from uh, Coal Town Coffee Roasters in Ammonford in Wales. And then you get your water boiling, my little camp stove. This is why it's so good for camping. The AeroPress Go is the uh, more small compact version. Uh, filter and your plunger, put it on top of your cup. Grab your water, pour it in, and uh, keep a little bit back just to put in the cup afterwards. Get your plunger in. Make sure you're there tight. And then you leave it sit, let it brew for five minutes. So then you just push your plunger down. Filter it through, and you end up with a cup of coffee. <coughs> and then with your filter, you just unscrew the bottom. And you got your little filter there. You can use it a few times if you want. Then you're going to want to take it out, get rid of this bit of coffee. It just comes out in a little puck like that. Screen bag on, it's good to go. Definitely recommend it if you're going camping. I don't want to be able to have uh, filter coffees while you're out. I bought mine off eBay used for 20. You can something. get them new for 30. Just make sure you get the AeroPress Go. And not just the AeroPress, because the AeroPress by itself is for uh, just home use, I think. So then when you're finished, you just take your filter, your plunger, turn it upside down, pop it back in, push it in there, pop a little filter case back on top, and then stick the lid back on, which is kind of made it like a rubber, so it grips to the top a little bit, and you're all good to go.